Most developers are in two different categories. One category think that AI will replace us, and secondly just lazily use AI and think that they are writing code on a senior level. During this time with AI I try to convince developers that AI doesn't make you senior. And now we are getting real truth based on researches that AI is not always speeding up the development process. And just from the beginning I want to tell you I am not against AI, I am using it every single day. But with important points. I don't use it on the lazy mode where I simply throw something to AI and ask it to generate a huge bunch of code. And secondly I am using AI as a learning tool so I become a better developer and make sure that AI won't replace me. And this is exactly what we start seeing in different reports. Like for example here you can see that AI tools might slow down experienced developers in complex projects. So this research involved 16 seasoned open source developers completing 246 real world tasks. So this research might not be huge, but it still shows some valid information. This is why actually we don't use AI at all in my middle to senior frontend bootcamp, because we plan architecture and cover code with tests and think everything ourselves, so you become a real senior developer. Most often senior developers are working on big systems that they already know. And then the help that AI can provide is much smaller than people expect it to be. Because for AI it is difficult to follow the huge difficult architecture, it will generate you a lot of files that you don't need and make your code more complex if you are not asking it to just change small chunks. As you can see here they tested tasks like bug fixes, feature implementations and refactoring. And they used different AI tools like for example Cursor. And they saw that with AI the time that they needed for the task was increased in complexion by 19%. But actually developers thought that they spent less time on it. And you for sure saw this when you are using AI yourself, you always try one more prompt and you think yes it will work right now, I just need to try once again. And then you just burn through time that you can use to just write the solution yourself. So the factors that contribute to this are reviewing outputs, prompting and waiting, complexity of coding databases and high quality standard. From what I mostly see for developers, the main problem of AI is hallucinations, generating too much code and having difficulties to follow patterns and rules that are there in any big project. So most developers feel that they are faster with AI, but it is not really true. And I highly recommend you to use some timer and try to implement the feature with or without AI and see how it goes. Additionally to that we must talk about security. Sometimes AI can generate the code that is not secure or recommend you patterns that is better not to use. And the main point is here that you must ship only code that you understand. AI can generate for you whatever, but you need to review it and understand 100% so you never ship compromised code. Additionally to that, almost all videos that you can see on YouTube which show you AI are doing that on a simple project. And yes, yeah, sure, AI always shine on simple projects, but not on the complex code basis. If you see videos like I created Netflix in 15 minutes, this is a lie. Because realistically they simply implemented the homepage of Netflix website, nothing else. It is just not realistic for AI to build in 15 minutes the clone of Netflix with all its cases and performance that people were building for years. Additionally to that, as you can see here, a lot of people are complaining that time that they got with AI is spent on longer code review. And this is completely obvious, if AI generated lots of code for you, it must be reviewed, sometimes it will be more complex, the amount of files that it generates will be much bigger, and if you don't control it step by step, you will also have these problems. And additional to that, the time that you need to debug AI code is much higher than the time that you will debug the human code. Because really often you can see the hidden errors that are not really clear on the first glance. So the real production value of AI is to help you generate small chunks of code and help you to become a better developer. 
So as you can see, coding lazily with the AI is not an answer. You still need to learn knowledge to become a senior developer. And actually, if you are serious in becoming a senior developer, I highly recommend you to check my middle to senior front-end bootcamp, where we focus on architecture, algorithms, passing interviews, and learning everything that senior developer must know. Check the link under the video.